Okay, using the fast principle now uh, with Brian, and you can d uh, use your uh, training partner. We're going to do the form, the accuracy, and the speed, and the timing to bring it all together. Now, Brian's going to role play for me, and he's going to role play the signs of an aggressive person. So he's going to stand up tall, usually square on, chest is out, he's going to make himself look big and he's going to be doing this with his head or pointing with his finger. This kind of sign. So, so he's going to be in my face. Generally not pushing in too much. Generally he will stand his ground just for a few seconds. Now in this situation now he's going to be shouting at me the words of the street where, wherever you live. It's going to be really upsetting. He's going to want me to get aggressive and, and angry and I've got to stay calm at this point. This is the most crucial point. So at this stage, I can put my hands out to give me some space, some thinking time so he can't drop the head on. And I can just put my hand out. I can catch him in the chest if he rushes me. And I've set him up for this strike. This is the one for this guy that I've seen I can get in on an angle. So now we're going to use the trigger. The pad's out to simulate the chin. And for the purpose of this training exercise, I'm going to use the trigger, please don't hit me. And on the me, I'm going to go. Okay, so Brian's there displaying signs and symptoms, and he's doing all this. And then he's going to put the pad out, and he's going to hold it there. And he's going to make himself big. I'm going to go, hey, please don't hit me. <coughs> and then I'm going to launch the strike. And that's how we're going to train it for the form and the timing as well. The accuracy is obviously on the pad. And we're going to keep repeating this with all the strikes. So for this purpose, it's this strike. From here or from here, it doesn't matter. Please don't hurt me. Hey, come on, please don't hurt me. We can go on the other hand, exactly the same. So I'm drilling it and drilling it so my body reacts the same every time. Hey, come on, please don't hurt me. Come on, please don't hurt me. For the elbow, it's exactly the same for an elbow strike. If we're going to bring it round here into the pad. If we're close in, please don't hurt me. <coughs> okay, now, now you can see that the trigger is the me. Now, it's going to be difficult for me to train this consistently and in a situation say, please don't hurt me and not throw it. It will actually come out whether I want it to or not. There's a mental trigger in my head that's going to make me do this drill, okay? Have fun with it, train it, train it, train it until it becomes second nature to you because come the day you're going to need this, if you freeze, you might die. Okay. <laughs> 